you exist for the benefit of earth, possession, organized darkness, and prophecy the day is 360 hours and starts at 3 p.m. after hitting the 3 a.m. meditation bells 15 times prior. This post's launch time is the East Coast USA 1111 morning gate, on the 3D date 041922, the following 3 p.m. will start this new day. Follow this parallel around the globe until it hits your local time at 3 p.m. The following new day will begin at 050422. If you are conscious that a new day has begun, send love and kindness to all. A general note, you are amongst family. Please feel free to reach out to any of the Archangelic community leaders if you need help with your approach to the assignments. Please visit us at archangelicalendar.com for more information and for translations in other languages. And please do not forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Thank you for your continued support. Today's date on the Archangelic calendar is, Infinity A62A1B6 Infinity Infinity H3 M3 M3 H3 M3 M3 H3 M3 M3 Infinity Infinity Q3 U3 U3 F3 F3 Infinity Infinity B5 D D Infinity Binary Conversion 1 0011101000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000
it is a giant macro inside a much vaster macro. Just because science can explain how Mother Nature works, it does not mean it is more significant. Nothing will stay in the same form forever. Earthly wars are archaic. Deep trust and fine-tuning of your intuition will be the key to mastering everything physical. It is helpful to see through all forms and get down to the essence and purpose of its existence. This statement includes you. You are not separate from this. There is a particular time when someone's paradigm breaks, and they lose a sense of the current reality. This situation is essential for someone on the path to higher consciousness. Consciousness is the bridge between the past and the future. Deeply engulfing yourself in the now to dive deep into its relationship with physical reality. Infinitely expanding creator source, insists upon expressing itself in every possible way. What you see around you is just that. All that is, needs to know itself and has birthed many different outcomes. Some are seen here, but many exist in other universes, timelines, and dimensions. You are experiencing life, in whatever way you are, from your perspective to help the divine macro understand itself better. It sees through your eyes, feels through your skin, and lives through your consciousness. You have a great purpose in whatever form you have chosen to take, and for that, we sincerely thank you. Possession, organized darkness, and prophecy. Why do people who are entirely rational act completely manic without warning? Organized darkness would be the answer. These impulses run through every man, woman, and child. Recently, we have seen world leaders become possessed by this evil energy, and if we dive deeper into this, we know this is not uncommon. The malevolent impulse running through humanity is what runs organized darkness. No thought is the micro self's own. Therefore, there must be another origin for negative ideas and urges. This collective is a well-established part of the macro and is an uncomfortable truth. Because what drives evil is a specific source that operates much as the benevolent macro does. In the same way, we have tuned ourselves to benevolence. Some have connected themselves to malice. Most people are on the median cusp of this and can receive both impulses, the devil and angel on their shoulders, and it explains a good deal about how human nature has developed. This situation is described in the Two Wolf story as well. This story, in short, says two wolves are fighting inside of us. One is good, and the other evil, and the one that will triumph is that one we feed. This malevolent macro energy can, take over, the will of someone unaware of this inner battle. In many cases, some people can go through their entire lives doing the will of malevolence without knowing it. Those who have the same situation but have been tuned to benevolence their entire lives usually realize it, and their free will is continually respected. Even our personality is a function of this macro situation as it gets hoarded by our micro perspective and altered by experience. Still, its origins are non-physical impulses that get picked up by our antenna, the mind. We are an antenna with the ability to accept or deny the incoming pulses, this is where discernment is pivotal. The second coming prophecy is in these impulses, the energy that will infect humanity will be from a higher source similar to one of ancient origins. Although it's not the second coming of anything, it's brand new energy that most humans could not digest until now, and thus it was unavailable. Today's tools. Tools will be active until the next, Archangelic Day. Use the legend below to help you decipher how to best use today's weapons. Passive, equals no intention needed to use or arm. It will work on its own when you accept its presence. You need to give permission, and it will work on your behalf. Active, equals intention needed to use. Aggressive, equals will attack before anything has a chance to harm you. Do not try to wield weapons if there is no pure love in your heart for your motions and the attached beings. General, we have a strong shield and armor set balanced with a profoundly powerful, violet flame. Archangel Metatron has all weapons available in his cache. The healing hand, left, is active and optimized, as is the striking hand. The violet flame is set for 9, 45 equals 4 plus 5 equals 9. The Violet Flame is now optimized for transmutation. The Violet Flame team is as follows and is in no particular order. Archangel Gzedrel, Archangel Galizer, Archangel Adnakil, 
Archangel Emmanuel, Archangel Serviel, Archangel Magdil, Archangel Bazarzath, Archangel Tuviel, Archangel Shemziel, Archangel Saniel, Archangel Bathkal, Archangel Zadquiel, Archangel Omil, Archangel Issa, Archangel Peliel, Archangel Faniel, Archangel Germain, Archangel Ansiel, Archangel Zadikiel, Archangel Briathos, Archangel Tatrazil, Archangel Eshma, Archangel Bariel, Archangel Af, Archangel Dakel, Archangel Abraxos, Archangel Adonai, Archangel Sizus, Archangel Varmil, Archangel Vadil, Archangel Dardriel, Archangel Agla, Archangel Nuriel, Archangel Uzil, Archangel Abistaran, Goddess Bridget, Goddess Freya, Archangel Orion, Goddess Hathor, Goddess Frigga, Goddess Galactica, Archangel Sablo, Archangel Kirkiel, Goddess Ceres, and Archangel Dabriel. Active Archangel Michael's Shiva legendary sword can handle anything, as it is entirely omnipotent, no level of consciousness can block this divine weapon. It is also a great weapon against electronics and technology as it can override any circuitry. Passive, active, and aggressive Archangel Isik's radiant field looks like Magneto's force field, and it reacts to any life form with either loving energy or a transmutation owl blast of vast power. Passive and aggressive Archangel Leo's Swords of Plenty is a passive and aggressive attack sword with its own complete will. Do not try to wield at all. You will only get in the way, equip and go. Passive and aggressive Archangel Shepherd's Orb is a divinity presence that allows anyone to encounter a clear path to forgiveness or a direct audience with infinitely expanding creator source. This tool is a genuinely compassionate tool of divine orchestration. Passive Archangel Teasdakeel's Pendant of Justice lessens all judgment against you and casts you in a favorable light. This tool is also helpful for general shielding. Active Archangel Zagzagal's Staff of Heavenly Might rains large crystal masses upon a targeted area. Great for large targets, works on the physical and non-physical as well. It is also known to part oceans and move mountains when asked. Passive and Active Archangel Ezekiel's Medal of Radiance allows you to radiate healing and protective energy to yourself and all you wish to send this. It is beyond beneficial for things obvious and not so obvious. Passive and aggressive Archangel Harut's Orb of Radiant Blast hits like a metaphysical neutron bomb to anyone who wishes to do you harm. It keeps anyone that may be giving you the evil eye from being able to harm you. Active and aggressive Archangel Rahab's levels balance, blesses, and direct large bodies of water effortlessly. It can also bring a flood of relieving energy to a target. Passive Archangel Azrael's staff allows you to see things from a divine perspective. It's a symbol of wisdom and equipping. This has incredible effects on your thought perception and coping with everyday life. Active Archangel Azrael's soul splitter has an aggressive attack upon anyone with a higher consciousness who wishes to harm any lower dimensional being. Its nickname comes from describing what it looks like in use. This tool is omnipotent to any evil force. Active, passive, and aggressive Archangel Azurul's auto gears automatically sets the proper parameters to make changes smooth and effortless. It is a great tool to end relationships of all kinds as it guarantees the event manifests for the greater good of all involved. Active then passive. Archangel Sandalphon's activation codes helps you download vast information easily. Intend to use this before meditating, but it can also be helpful day to day. Aggressive and passive Archangel Cocoville's energy control staff can regulate the flow of energetic currents, reverse them, or redirect them. This tool is also great for making grids and activating majestic structures. Active Kali Mars Trident can handle anything as it is entirely omnipotent. Extremely useful on all things. It is an excellent weapon against electronics and technology, as it can override any circuitry, a perfect tool for any assignment. Passive Archangel Temperance's Health Elixir rejuvenates all aspects of your being with a steady stream of potent healing energy designed to help in good health and in bad. Allow this tool to work on your behalf by telling Archangel Temperance to make it so, 
Active and passive Archangel Metatron's levitation orb allows you to feel lighter in any given situation. It does not matter how dense the circumstances you rise above and feel nothing in your protective bubble. Passive and aggressive Archangel Hermesiel's heavenly horn is the lead instrument in all heavenly choirs. It is instantly recognizable as it sends love direct through our heart chakra. It is known to change the dynamics of all things in your jurisdiction. When this is armed, a vibrational shield forms around your circumference. Passive Archangel Vahu Mana's timepiece allows you to savor a positive feeling or thought. It brings an element of majesty to your everyday moments, and it prevents the interference of harmful time travelers. Passive Active and aggressive Archangel Chamul's Radiant Peace allows you to be secluded in a peaceful bubble, no matter what is happening around you. This tool also allows those in your heart to have protection as well. Passive and active Archangel Jeremiel's Enhanced Intuition enables your soul's voices to become louder. It allows the spirit nudges to be more evident than ever. Active Archangel Barakil's Lightning Rod is an advanced engineering tool, Place the rod in the center of a temple and activate it independently. This tool saves us a good deal of effort. Passive and aggressive Archangel Barachiel's orb is excellent to encourage the healing of old wounds. This orb is perfect for supporting your dreams and ambitions, but it can also knock beings into another galaxy when necessary. Aggressive Archangel Balthiol's spinning blades can thwart any distress that you may experience, and it can also keep all of your enemies at bay. Even if a seven-nation army is against you, it will bring them to their knees before they can even formulate a plan. Passive Archangel Jophiel's Radiance is a beautiful tool that allows our inner beauty to shine. This tool is great but can make people possessive over you as the beauty is very intense. Use this tool in a trusted company only. Passive Archangel Yabashiel's Sandals allows your footsteps to bless the earth without any extra effort. This tool enables our subconscious selves to be actively involved in the healing process of Gaia. Passive Archangel Rajuriel's Archive Key allows you access to new areas of knowledge and wisdom. This also gives you better access to the Akashic Records and summons Archangels to your side as needed. Passive and aggressive Archangel Softihose's Wand of Scales measures the hearts of all things, living and non-living. It judges its merits and either encourages its growth or diminishes its influence upon physical reality. This tool is much like a pencil as it has both arrays and creation options. Passive Archangel Zophiel's Intel brings your intuition a briefing to go along with your gut instincts. This tool can tell you exactly why you feel a certain way by leaving the guesswork out. If you are not clairaudient, Zophiel will get the message to you in other ways. Passive Archangel Haniel's Shield of Truth protects the honest and kind-hearted with ferocious intensity. It is wise to be pure of mind and intentions, or the shield will not activate. Passive Archangel Harahil's Index helps recall past lives and future lives and all other points of personal interest. The Great Library Keeper has more knowledge of living records than any other known being. Passive Archangel Caspiel's Tide Changer turns all momentum in your favor. It manifests like translucent ocean waves surrounding you. Envision this delicate liquid washing over whatever is troubling you. Aggressive Archangel Sagnasagil's Body Guarding Services compellingly watches over you. Evoke this tool for a boost to your protection entourage. Passive Archangel Heman's Song places well timed music into your life. Heman exclusively speaks through music. Permitting this tool will deliver these messages. Active and passive Archangel Dubiel's Staff of Bear Medicine can heal all natural things. This staff is also a powerful ally against all items that may obstruct you. Active and passive Archangel Chileel's Horn summons an army of unimaginable power to your location. This horn is a hypersensitive tool and it will adapt to current events in your life and on a global scale. Passive Archangel Ophemiel's Charm of Divine Permission permits the divine hand of infinitely expanding Creator Source to intervene in your life directly. Passive Archangel Sophia's Wisdom is a friendly voice that helps you via grace and virtue. 
you can use this passively or evoke to start a dialogue with Archangel Sophia. Passive and aggressive, Archangel Dras Cosmic Shield, aggressively protects the person who accepts its grace. This tool covers the individual from advanced weaponry, EMF, and other attacks. Passive and aggressive Goddess Marat's Shield of Justice, does not allow false accusations or unjust punishment to affect you. It brings the light of truth to every situation and conspires to allow things to work out in your favor. Passive, Archangel Lofiel's Bautonir Air, enhances the beauty of yourself and all that you survey. This modality must get your, okay, to work on your behalf like all passive tools. Passive, Archangel Jejathun's Radiant Sounds, attract the most beautiful people to your life and enhance your surroundings with beautiful cosmic sounds. Audible downloads will become readily available. Passive, Archangel Jefuska's Atmospheric Bracelet, brings an element of fun to your nights. Jefuska is the Archangel in charge of gatherings. She would be the recommended party planner if you have one. Active, Archangel Gabrielle's Dual Ficker Sword, brings down negative energies and anything attached. This sword will affect beliefs, followers, henchmen, etc. In other words, it does not stop at the point presented to it, it continues until there is nothing left of its essence. Passive and aggressive, Archangel Raguel's Orb of Reassurance, is like having a supportive best friend in your ear. It is incredibly entertaining and amazingly wise, much like Archangel Raguel. A fantastic communication tool. Passive, active, and aggressive, Archangel Barman's sightseeing orbs, will break down all things and can break us free from any veils of deception. This tool looks like bubbles with clear images inside them, this comes in handy in many ways, obvious and not. Active and passive, Archangel Zadikiel's hink, as he calls it, is like an angelic Swiss army knife that can be useful to open or close a portal, activate a grid, and help manifest your desires. This brilliant tool creates conscious energy. Passive, Archangel Taggers on the aid, is a tool that helps you hear above, below, and around someone's spoken words. This tool shows you the real intentions behind someone's comments, it's also an excellent tool for reading cuneiform. Aggressive, Archangel Shaquille's protective gaze, protects you from any harmful situations nine steps before they would have ever reached your door. This tool is a great peacekeeper as it doesn't allow anything dangerous to come anywhere near you. Aggressive, Goddess Lakshmi's blessing, can convert pain into pleasure. This tool turns everything into a miracle waiting to manifest, it can also guarantee human survival necessities. Passive Goddess Abundantia's Gifts of Divinity, brings welcomed surprises to your day. This tool is incredible at seeing the user is, well fed and well rested, this means that you will not need anything, because it is there before the need arrives. In a deficit, this tool will help bridge the gap as your belief allows. Passive and aggressive, Archangel Muriel's Sword of Stone, is a dynamic weapon that can harness the Earth's power. This sword can summon or silence earthquakes and bring peace to an active volcano. Passive, Archangel Kamal's Headdress, gives you an insight into your inner talents and abilities. Set the intention and use it right before meditation, you will not regret it. Passive, Archangel Raziel's Universal Key, allows access to all wisdom, knowledge, and kingdoms. This key is a beautiful and wild ride that can take you anywhere. Active, aggressive, and passive Archangel Expedit's Wand of Speed, drastically decreases wait time in all situations. This tool helps with big and small things, one of the only devices that work equally well macro and micro. Active Archangel Ariel's Wand of Comforts, helps you summon any necessity you may have. It is a beautiful and comforting tool when equipped. Active, aggressive, and passive Archangel Israfil's Flaming Sword, can protect you against all things directed to you on a macro or micro scale. It can also speed up the wait time when something you wish to manifest will come to fruition. Active, aggressive, and passive Archangel Nasaragil's Flaming Sword, can bring any negative energy to its knees. It also can remove all obstacles in the way of something you wish to manifest. Passive Green Tara's Lion's Roar, brings compassionate healing to all things. This tool works wonders on addictions and inner healing, provided the target wishes to heal. 
Note, you cannot send this modality to another person without their permission. Active Goddess Segment's healing touch soothes all physical, spiritual, and mental wounds. Call upon this tool when you are not feeling your best. Passive Archangel Ishmael's orb of new connections attracts true friends and loyal hearts to your efforts on a micro and macro scale. Passive and aggressive Archangel Kalesiel's radiant rays of health wards off all diseases and illnesses. It can also help recover conditions already inflicted. It works on landmasses and individual living beings. Passive and aggressive Archangel Thelial's radiant compassion sends heartfelt love to all within your jurisdictions. This tool is the nurturing aspect of healing, and it has incredible warmth. It is best to wield this with a calm frame of mind. Active Archangel Raphael's healing staff is an omnipotent healing force that works gradually or intensively depending on how you wield it. It is considered the best general healing instrument. Today's assignments, please use today's tools if you need assistance performing the tasks below. Nothing requires you to do the following. If you are ready, your higher self will call you to duty. If not, skip ahead to the meditation. When working alone, please note it is always advised to hold metaphysical modalities for at least a 360 count. You must always be ready for unexpected calls to metaphysical action without our prompting. Please note, today's assignments are in cooperation with many moving parts. This is our job. We must do it to the best of our ability, the same way the other teams on separate tasks will. The entrance and exit portals we created here are still optimized and ideal for use. General assignments, asterisk implement a multi-dimensional violet flame by reaching for the highest level of consciousness available to you at the movement, ignite that violet flame there and bring it down, engulfing dimension upon dimension until it falls upon the earth and the physical realm in general. Since you have initiated this flame in the higher dimensions, allowing this flame to burn itself is optimal. It takes a great deal of control to sustain the flame without adding anything to it once it reaches earth. It takes even more power to hold this for an extended time, and it is a matter of letting go, observing yet not attached, doing yet not doing. For you, the very gifted, this will eventually become effortless. We will implement healing from the higher dimensions using the same technique as we did with the multi-dimensional violet flame, except with emerald green. To help the people situation in Ukraine, start by sending the following to the region, pink modalities, light, breeze, water, healing ice, flame, thundering light, plasma, and ray light. Then connect the hearts of those who had to stay in the war-torn area and their families who had to flee by connecting them with a white light cord. Then engulf both parties with the following emerald green modalities, healing ice, light, water, plasma, flame, and electrical strikes. To take this one step further, engulf all parties engaging in violence on both sides with violet flame, orange flame, and pink flame. Feel free to use a hailing violet flame and an atomic smash. If you feel so inclined, there is a plethora of abandoned nuclear devices on the ocean floor, some newer, some older. Locate and destroy these items with the following light blue modalities, flame, light, crystalline light, ray light, gamma ray light, waters, electric strike, thundering light, and plasma. To keep peace and help the people of Taiwan engulf Taiwan and its circumference 25 miles in all directions in the following, emerald green modalities, flame, light, crystalline light, ray light, gamma ray light, waters, electric strike, thundering light, and plasma. We are seeing an epidemic of malicious walk-ins on earth. If a walk-in has already found a host, sever their connection with a metaphysical strike to the brain stem and escort them out via an exit portal. If they have not found a host, you can handle them easily in the ether with sword and shield and an exit portal. The killing stone in Japan has split in two, releasing an evil spirit with no business here. It has been locked away in this prison for 1,000 years and is now free. Locate the being who escaped and escort him through an exit portal, by all means necessary. You can use sword and shield, flames, 
or even, words of authority, to accomplish this, use your instincts. Enhance and protect humankind by infusing their aura with a golden light shield. Astral time travel and astral positioning assignments. Engulf the following years in violet flame, 13 BC, 6 BC, 6, 13, 40, 118, 254, 430, 726, 1172, 1268, 1331, 1338, 1621, 1699, 1745, 1999, 2000, 2001, 2011, 2012, 2014, 1016, 2018, 2020, 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025. Engulf the following years in Rainbow Plasma 2022, 2023, 2024, 2025, 2179, 2241, 2316, 2424, 2613, 3133, 3213, 3464, 3510, 3591, 4422, 4563, 5155, 5612, 6323, 6363, 6473, 6640, 7043, 7321. Engulf the following dimensions with rainbow flame and rainbow light 1D, 2D, 3D, 4D, 5D, 6D, 12D, 13D, 22D, 34D, 35D, 40D, 41D, 44D, 56D, 64D, 73D, 83D, 91D, 118D. Heavily violet flame. The ethereal plane, astral realm. Enhance the following celestial time gates and number codes with rainbow electrical strikes. 101, 111, 1111, 222, 333, 444, 555, 123, 1234, 1010, 909, 808, 707, 606, 5051 AM to 9 AM. Stop the siphoning event on February 27, 22 in Santa Monica, CA. There is a catastrophic event that could take place if not for this effort. Stop the catastrophe in Los Angeles in 2024 by engulfing the said place and time in the following, healing ices, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. If you see anything else that needs attention here, please use the modalities that first come to mind work on these places, in all dimensions that it exists in with great focus and intensity. The White Pyramid, located 100 kilometers outside of China's Xi'an, is a gigantic pyramid that holds many secrets about the Earth. To extract this information, engulf the pyramid in the following, orange modalities, flame, light, crystalline light, ray light, gamma ray light, waters, electric strike, thundering light, and plasma. 9 billion light years away, two black holes are about to collide, sending shock waves throughout existence. While we cannot stop this collision because of free will, we can contain the impact zone with a giant, mirrored box that can hold the consequences to its facilitators, thus preventing any collateral damage. Asterisk It is a good general practice to leave the entirety of reality in divine orchestration as we finish up our work. An atomic shake is a tool implemented when you purposefully rattle physical reality down to the atomic level. Many have called this zero point a place where everything is neutral and receptive, but they are unaware that to reach a true zero point, one must direct the atom's landscape to do so. You can set an intention before or after the shake, but a purpose must be present. This tool is an excellent tool for ceremonies or puja.
we will start our closing with this modality from this point forward. Try to hold atomic shake throughout the rest of the closing while implementing the following healing modalities. Engulf the earth in the following healing ices white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following flames white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following breezes, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Winds of change flames breezes. Please use both modalities simultaneously and make them one. White, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following metaphysical salts. White, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following electrical strikes, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following waters, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following thundering lights, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following crystalline lights, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth with the following gamma ray lights, white ray, blue ray, yellow ray, pink ray, green ray, ruby ray, and violet ray. Engulf the earth with the following ray lights, white ray, blue ray, yellow ray, pink ray, green ray, ruby ray, and violet ray. Engulf the earth in the following lights, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following plasmas, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. Engulf the earth in the following cloud cover, white, pink, light blue, gold, yellow, green, red, brown, black, gray, teal, rose gold, silver, orange, indigo, violet, platinum, diamond, and rainbow. We will be finishing with a technique called, blinding light. Light is so intense that it is not available in our current light spectrum and thus void of color. You can flash this modality or hold it firm. The most critical part is implementing indiscernible light. Thank you for your service. Today's meditation is above. Please enjoy.